Hello gentlemen, how are you? After a long time, I am going to make a video how to calculate cut pipeline. See, this is our isometric drawing. You can see here, in isometric drawing, we have the reference drawing. You can see here, we have the reference drawing. In isometric drawing, first we check the north. So we have north this side. Now for this drawing we have the soft materials here. You can see here. These are the soft materials. And the welding points we have here 14. So in isometric drawing we will start how to calculate cut pipeline. This is our direction direction x direction y direction z so we will go to like this from here to here then here then here then here then down this is z direction so now we will calculate pipeline one by one so we will start point from x See, we start here. We have how many pipes we have here? Around seven. So pipe number one is here from from here. This is point point here two point one. This is number one and point two is here from here to here. You can see this is two and pipe number three we have here from here to here then we have pipe number four you can see here pipe number four from here to here then we have pipe number six, five from here to here then we have pipe number six from here to here then pipe number seven from here to here now step by step we will calculate cut pipe length number one pipe. So here we have this drawing we have drawn here same same. Here from point here to here we have the length 2500 millimeter. See now we will check here part number F6. In the drawing we will check F6. Here is the part number F6. We have slip on flange. You can see here slip on flange. Now we will calculate pipe number one. We have the length 2500 minus. Now, why we are doing minus? We have here slip on flange. We assume 26 millimeter for silicone flange minus 26 millimeter will get see 2500 minus 26 will get 2474 millimeter hmm. now we will calculate for pipe second here See, you can see here pipe number second. We'll start point is here. Now the end point for pipe number second is here. Total measurement is given 1900 millimeter. Now for pipe number second, we have here part number three. We have here elbow 90 degree you can see here this is elbow 90 degree so from total length we will make minus elbow 90 degree we will calculate elbow center for elbow 90 degree we have rule to calculate elbow 90 is 38.1 and the pipe size we have the pipe size here that is mentioned 3 inch. If 
we have any size we will put here now in this drawing we have 3 million uh, 3 inch here 1900 minus 38.1 into 3 we have 114.3 we get double zero minus 114.3 1785.7 millimeter this this measurement is from here to here because we make minus elbow 90 see we make minus elbow 90 degree so this measurement is this measurement now let's see cut pipe 3 see cut pipe 3 we have here elbow 90 degree we have here a 20 see we will check part number 7 part number 7 is equality see for equality the measurement is given here 86 millimeter total length is for part number 53 total length 26 milli 2600 millimeter minus equal to the measurement is given 86 here also we have 90 degree so make minus you know the rule for calculating 90 degree point 38.1 into the pipe size is 3 we will make minus so here we will calculate minus 86 minus 38.1 into 3 114.3 here we have 86 plus 114.3 we'll get 2600 minus 200.3 here 2600 minus 200.3 point 3 2399.7 millimeters here this measurement is from here to here this one so we will now calculate cut pipe 4 here we have the cut pipe 4 the length is from this point to this point we have 1500 1500 now this is part number F5. You can see here F5 we have here well neck flange. You can see here part number well neck flange. For well neck flange, the measurement is given 70. You can see here that is given 70 millimeter. For equality, here this is, this is equality that is given. 86 millimeter see now here this is oil neck flange 70 millimeter minus equal to 86 millimeter now we will calculate here 1500 minus 70 we will get minus again 86 we will get here 
1344 मिलीमीटर नाउ वी विल कैलकुलेट कट पाइप नंबर 5 द लेंथ स्टार्ट्स फ्रॉम हियर दिस पॉइंट टू दैट पॉइंट now we have a 20 and we have elbow 45 degree so we will check part number 8 part number 8 we have here elbow 45 degree see you can see here now we will calculate the length total length is 1600 so for equality that is given 86 mm minus 86 now we have here elbow 45 degree we have the rule to calculate elbow center of elbow 45 degree 15.8 into size of the pipe 3 inch 1600 minus 86 so we we'll calculate here 15.8 into 3 we'll get 47.4 now here one here 86 plus Four seven point four equal to one six double zero minus one three three point four. Here one six double zero minus one three three point four. We'll get one four. Six six point six millimeter. This length is this length. You can see from here to here, this much. Now we will calculate pipe number six. See, we will start. The length is given from this point to this point. Here. Part number eight, we have elbow forty-five degree. Here, part number three, we will check part number three here in the drawing, axiomatic drawing. Three, we have ninety degree elbow. So we will calculate here. Six. Total length is given one five five zero. Now we have here elbow forty-five degree. The rule fifteen point eight and pipe size is three inch minus elbow ninety degree. We calculate elbow center thirty-eight point one into pipe size three inch. Now one five five zero. We will calculate here one five. Point eight into three. We will get forty seven point four minus thirty eight point one into three. We will get one one four point three. Now one five five zero. We have. Four seven point four plus one one four point three. We'll get one six one point seven. Here we have one five five zero minus. One six one 
0.7 we'll get 1388.3 millimeter so this is length is this much from this point to this point will be 1388.3 millimeter now we will calculate for cut pipe 7 cut pipe 7 start from this point to this point so this point is part number 3 we have 90 degree elbow and this one we will check here 4 part number 4 we will check here from the drawing we have concentric reducer and the concentric reducer the value is given 89 millimeter you can see here 89 millimeter now total length we have one four five zero minus again rule of how to calculate elbow center of 90 degree is 38.1 and the pipe size is 3 inch again we have minus 89 that is given in the drawing now we calculate 1450 minus 38.1 into 3 114.3 minus 89 so 114.3 plus 89 minus 203.3 so here 1450 minus 203.3 we'll get here 1246.3 7 millimeter. This is a length for pipe 7. For pipe 7, we have this length. Thank you guys. If you have any questions, kindly comment in the comment box. Thank you.